Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls for Dummies, the only series where we show you everything you need to know for your Dark Souls 3 playthrough. So, you just made it through the Profane Capital in the Earthful Dungeon, and now you're on to Yorm the Giant. So, the things you're going to need for this fight are no weapons at all. Then you're going to need the Estus Ring, the Karthus Milk Ring, and then anything you can have to increase your health. So, with that said, go ahead and hop into the boss fog. And you're gonna just go on straight towards the big guy. And as you can see, there's an item on the right side of his chair. So you're gonna go ahead and run over to that. Run through his first attack. Go ahead and grab that item. Then once you grab the Storm Ruler, run through his legs, open up your inventory, and put the Storm Ruler in your main hand. Then, once you do that, uh, this is kind of a unique weapon. What you do with this one is you go under his legs and hold our, uh, left trigger to charge the weapon, then you can tell it's fully charged when it remains glowing even after you let go of left, tr left trigger. Then you're just going to keep circling around his attack until you see an opportunity to attack, in which case you're going to hold left trigger and tap right bumper. And then once you hit him, if you hit him in the head it will stagger him. Then so you're just going to go back to the same strategy from last time, try and get under his legs and start uh, charging up that weapon, making sure to wait for that glow. There we go. So, now you can wait for another attack. Try and hit his head once again. If you do miss, that's okay. Generally, you'll have enough time to recover. So, now you're just gonna wanna go ahead and back under the go. You guys know the drill, easy peasy. Yeah. The slam attack is very good to punish on, so make sure to always try and go for the slam attack. Once you get two hits in, that will send him in the second phase. That will give you enough time to charge your weapon. So go ahead and just send that out. So, then after that, his attacks will be doing quite a bit more damage than before, and also will have a little bit more of an area of effect to him. Uh, luckily, his stomp still does no damage to you, so don't be too worried if he sends that out uh, at you. So, then you're just going to try and get around a couple of his attacks before you go for your attack. There we go. Unless you miss again. That was beautiful, but no, we'll make it through. Back to the legs. Then charge, try and... Yep, there we go. If he uses that attack, that's kind of a good thing. It will kind of force you away from him, which will give you some distance. Remember to aim for that head so you can stagger him. Try and get that last charge. There we go. Try and bait around the last attack. And send it off. And you should be good. And that is how you beat Norm the Giant. Uh, the reason we are not going to be doing a mage take for this particular boss is this boss only dies to the Storm Ruler. So using a mage, uh, I'd just be using the Storm Ruler as well. So, if you guys did enjoy the video, please remember to like and subscribe to continue getting back to the basics.